Welcome back, back to the basement, the, the friendliest, friendliest place, place on YouTube. YouTube. Last time in Wind Waker, we got the iron boots. Last time. And uh, we were definitely uh, facing off against this thing. So when we turned on the on the, uh, on the the old Wii U, it was like, oh, shoot, I'm getting shot at. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, shoot. Yeah. Don't shoot. Ah! Literally shoot. Uh, episode 39 was the last episode of the evening. Here we are um, a few weeks later recording the first episode of the evening. So I have to remember, if I'm going to talk about any sort of current-ish events, this is the video to talk about it. At the beginning of the session, not the end of the session. I actually discussed that in the last video, I think. Oh, I stink at this. You are quite bad at it. Running low on bombs. <laughs> just a bandit ship. <laughs> <laughs> King of Red Lions is like, ah, uh, no, you don't. <laughs> Excuse me. There, boom. Got Take him. Take that, you dingus. You got him. Put it away. Let's set sail. All right, so we got some important stuff we're gonna do in this episode, and as soon as we know what that is, uh, oh, we'll start yeah. doing it. So we we got our uh, <laughs> we got our iron boots, which means we need to go back to the place where there is wind. All right. It uh, kind of sent us on a little bit of a fetch quest, didn't it? Where it was like, oh, yeah. you want to get in here? You're going to need the sacred whatever. And then you go there to get the sacred whatever. And it's like, oh, the elemental island requires different elemental arrows. Right. And I used up all my arrows on my wife, so you had to do that. Go get the fire arrows to access Ice Island to get the heavy boots. Right. The uh, cheat sheet is right in front of you on the gamepad there. I know the I know the song. I just couldn't get it to do what I wanted it to do. Oh. Also, Ted gets his up and down confused. And it was really annoying to me. Um, I don't remember where we're trying to go. Well, either of those uh, highlighted islands is probably a thing. I think that one up on top is probably where we wanted to go. Um, the the stupid this was not made well. <laughs> this is what I'm trying to get the game? at. Yes, because musically, higher notes would be like higher on the st on the sticks. Yeah, you know, and if I was going to, like, ooh, cool! I didn't ever realize there was a compass. That's really handy when you have this sail and you don't know which way the wind is blowing. Um, so we can just head north. The when you pull out the wind waker, the highest note is on the bottom. And there's like no logic to which notes are where yeah. on that four note continuum, yeah. which really messes with me because as a musician, yeah. I like to think, well, as a keyboardist, I suppose if I played flute more or like saxophone, a I flautist, feel like, yes, as a flautist, a saxophone, if, if I was one of those, I don't think we have enough um, fish food to, no, we don't. Um, Oh, look at! I think we did the right thing. I think we did do the right thing. Hey, where'd you warp to to get here? Is this Windfall? A windfall is right behind us. Uh, is Windfall where Grandma is? No, no, that's Outset. Yeah. We should go to Outset and get some of Grandma's suit because we have bottles, don't we? We do have bottles. We have two fairies in the bottles. Oh, so our bottles are good. full of fairies. Okay. Um, items. I gotta put the boots. So a little earlier in this episode, I said Ted gets his up confused with his down, but I was going for very loosely, which was not intuitive at all is some people get their left and right confused which i can kind of understand yeah does anyone get their up and down confused i do when it's like aiming and some games do well like, yeah an airplane so you can invert the y-axis that right. makes sense but i'm just saying in life like because in life people get their left and right confused uh do we do you need to pull out your wind walker i don't think it's a wind waker do you need What's to... that weird sound? Hammer. I bet it's a hammer thing. Oh, yeah. Take that, you Octorock. Octorocks! Man, that little thing was producing all that wind. Like, you know it, it wasn't coming from behind that. It was all coming from within. You got my Korok leaf. Yeah. <gasps> there was an arrow. Uh, a single, arrow. A solitary arrow. Solitary arrow. Solitero. <laughs> Solitero. You were getting there. Wow, it's a six note song. Oh, I thought it was just some sort of like interesting design. <gasps> hey, it's the theme song of the game. Ba -ba -da 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 -da. 
This song is so dumb. Yeah, the bottom note is left. The next to bottom note is right. So up is the highest note. But down but is the, the next down highest is the note. next highest. Right. Yeah, that da, is weird. Da, da, da. As a fellow musician, I can concur that that's weird. And for each of the time signatures, the notes are different too. Oh, really? Yeah. You. But they're not. The, I'm guessing it follows the same logic, where it's like up is the highest, down is the next highest, and then the other ones are left and right. Or is this the most haunted? I am Zelda Fado. game. No. Everyone's a ghost. No, not everyone's a. The most haunted Zelda game is probably Breath of the Wild. I'm Fado of the Kokiri oh, tribe. Oh, that's true. I know I appear to you as a child, but the eyes can oft deceive. I am a most esteemed sage. Also, I have no eyes. Hmm. I want to be a dentist. <laughs> I had been praying here so the power to repel evil would continue to be contained with the blade of the master sword. Oh, I just thought of that Look abominable that guy. snowman. <laughs> there he is. I yeah, want to be, to be a dentist. dentist. Uh, but I was attacked by the evil Ganondorf, and this is what happened to me. Ganondorf. I became translucent. You wish to return the power to your blade, don't you? Uh, how yeah, did you know I sounds have a good to me. In that case, look for the one who has the same instrument that I hold and teach him the song you just played. Is how that about mayonnaise? You, how about you give me your instrument? Once you do, I'm certain the holder of this instrument will feel the blood. What? Wind Waker, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I don't care. There's so much text. Yeah, just, just blast through it. Nobody. It's. That's the. Oh, I thought he was going to turn into a chest. <laughs> uh, a strong man's chest. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! Yeah, there that appear ghost to didn't be even need to appear. Know. Didn't I? I did it though, didn't I? Oh shoot, we probably should have. You checked after. Yeah, I already played the song. Yeah, but if you hit, if you uh, hold out your Wind Waker, hold it up or whatever, and mm -hmm. see your cheat sheet. Yeah, it's on your gamepad, so we know that. We know the new one, the Wind God's Aria. Did he say where we need to go with this? He probably uh, It was probably in the text. That no, was... he said look for somebody holding this instrument. So that's probably oh. going to be at the Deku tree where there's the little... Yeah, the little guy. Concert. <laughs> Makar. You forgot it. I mean, you remembered his I name. I know. It's weird. I think it's Makar. I think you're right. Good job. Um, speaking of which, I hope my car is in my garage. <laughs> oh! So I don't have to use my scraper to get all the snow off tomorrow. I hope my car is in my garage so I don't have to use my phone to call the police because it was stolen. <laughs> also, if my car is there, that would be super handy. I could just teach him this song. Uh, let's do the <laughs> Ballad of the Gales. <laughs> you know what makes songs funny? Vibrato. When you wish upon a star, <laughs> Man, we need to get maps of some stuff. I'm going to go outset. We're going to use a fairy and we're going to buy some grandma soup. Or get some grandma soup. Yeah, because you can drink it twice, right? Exactly. So we're going to use a fairy. You don't automatically drink it when you die. Correct. You so, do need to preemptively drink soup. Yeah, preemptive soup. Man, I gotta tell you, yesterday I preemptively drank some soup. Oh yeah? It was delicious. I wasn't hungry I yet, was but at, I was gonna be. This was actually a real story. Um, so I, I went to a place myself. called Three Squares. Oh, I'm familiar with that place. We took our wives there, and we need to take our wives out again. <laughs> yeah, we do. <laughs> it's been like three years <laughs> since <laughs> we did this. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, went to Three Squares and they had the most amazing soup. My wife it was loves delicious. soup. She loves soup. If you say soup, she goes, oh, I love soup. Every time. Oh, really? Yeah, you mentioned soup. Oh, I love soup. Oh my like god. Like she just remembered it. That's so funny. Next time she's down here, I'm going to try to remember to do that. Oh, I love soup. Uh, so, what kind of amazing soup did they have? You don't have enough rupees. Did I, did I buy any? I think I did buy some. Oh, I was only able to afford one. Can we sell? One bundle of three. Bye. Wow, he's like, you don't have enough money to buy anything. Bye. So we were able to afford one bundle of three. Yeah, it, it's three and yet one. Like a certain three slash one gods I know. Mm. <laughs> hey, I wonder if the mail's going to have money in it. 
Has somebody, uh, there must be videos on the internet comparing the uh, three Triforce of power, courage, and wisdom to God the Father and... Oh, I'm sure. Would Jesus be courage? Zuko. And the Holy Spirit be wisdom? I guess. Nico, brother, hey, sending money to you. I'll loan you my telescope for a little longer, but you gotta give it back. Errol's sending me money. Oh, come on, you're hanging out with pirates. They've gotta have more money there. Remember in Ocarina of Time where the uh, balloons? Saria gives you her ocarina and you're like, wow, oh. this is the most special, tender, <laughs> spiritual, emotional, romantic moment between soulmates ever. And then later you get the Ocarina of Time and you're like, see ya. <laughs> You Throw just, this garbage out of here! Yeah. Zing! It's not even blue! <laughs> you never get it. It's not even blue. Oh, that's so original Zelda. It's not even a blue one. <laughs> I want a blue boomerang. Boomerang? Blue boomerang. A bloomerang. Red ring? Blue ring. Actually, the red ring's better. <laughs> that's true. But that it's is true. Not better than no ring. Zelda, the original Zelda was weird because sometimes it felt like red and blue, and sometimes it felt like orange and blue. Like the dark mm. nets are red and blue, and the red ones yeah. are easier. They take fewer hits, and the blue ones are harder. But with the whiz robes, it's again, the blue ones are harder, but the orange ones are easier. They're orange and not red. No, weren't the blue... I'm pretty sure the blue dark nuts were harder than the red dark nuts. That's what I said. They're, but the blue are harder in both cases, but it's blue versus red for dark nuts and blue versus orange for whiz robes. Oh, yeah. But I feel like the dark nuts, they, they, they were like orange with red. Like, it, they, they appeared orange because they had almost like that yellow outline on yeah, them. Yeah, it's like there were two different... Yeah... And I think they were supposed, or like I think they were supposed to be orange, but they came across as red. Does that make sense? I don't know if I yeah. want to crawl in there. There's only a green rupee. Yeah, it's like stop. It's like Bill Gates stopping to pick up a penny on the sidewalk. If he just literally gets to where he's going a fifth of a second earlier, he'll make a hundred million dollars. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> wow. That's a lot of money. That is a lot. If only well, we had a Breath of the Wild horse. But that's, I mean, that's also assuming that he's not just passively making money either. Did you forget where Grandma's going? No, I'm trying to get some money because I would like to buy more. Did you get Grandma? Is There's got to be a better spot to get money. Did you get I'm sure there is. Grandma's... Uh, I didn't get the soup yet. I was just going to see if we I We should roll the anything. snowball down the hill. That game's really easy to cheese. Oh, yeah, it's true. That's in Breath of the Wild, Peter. Hey, this isn't Breath of the Wild. Thumbnail idea. <laughs> <laughs> For those of you who don't know, we played Twilight Princess and it took us 72 episodes and somewhere around episode 60 something maybe, Breath of the Wild came out and we started playing that and oh my did we play that a lot. And then when we picked Twilight Princess back up, it just felt like, like wrong. A turd. You couldn't climb anything. <laughs> it was so terrible. The game was like, ugh. It's all like, stiff and yeah. Link when Link moves around, he's like he looks like a wooden man. Yeah, it looks like Pinocchio. I was watching some uh, Twilight Princess today, and while the Which game, ones? um, dude, remember the clown game where you go up in the thing and there's all those clowns and you gotta take a cuckoo and float down and pop all the balloons. You yes. hated that episode. You're not a big clown guy. I just don't like that guy. clown guy. Yeah. You married a clown. She's not a real clown. Yes, she is. She clowned around wow. once or twice. Who doesn't? <laughs> Have you ever seen uh, that... Uh, You're such a well-mannered there's boy. A, there's a, there's a, a video online mm -hmm. where Tim and Eric... Mm -hmm. Do you know who Tim and Eric mm -hmm. Awesome show? Great job. Those guys are? Uh, No. Okay, so they make the most weird, random videos you've ever seen in your life. Perfect. Um, and they're they're quite hilarious, but you have to kind of get their humor because it's it's really weird, Peter. It's okay. like really, really weird. Okay. Um, but that's, that's good to did, know. Did you ever see that did a do do video? Did a do do. Now slap those hands, feather those bangs. Think about your dad. What's your dad like? <laughs> I want to meet that dad. <laughs> What? No. Okay. No. <laughs> I'll like, show it to you I later. I thought maybe when you said clap your hands, I was thinking that everybody clap, clap your hands. hands. Yeah, I mean it kind of comes across a little bit like that okay. idea. But um, all right, we've got Gales. Hold on. 
We've got skies of blue, red so, king of the There's a video where too. these guys um, are on. Yeah, I don't know where Shaking this place Shaking our wind waker for me and for you. Yeah, I, I suppose I'm probably just going right. east. Huh. Time to get a fairy in a bottle. <laughs> Who's that guy? Louis Armstrong? That guy. Yeah. But anyway, there's a video online where they're like on Conan, or maybe it's like a... I was thinking Lance Armstrong. I knew that wasn't right. They're on some show. I think it maybe it's uh, Colbert. Anyway, they... Uh, they walk out and they're dressed like clowns. Because <laughs> they're like... <laughs> Are they weirder than um, Wallace and Gromit? Yes. Are they weirder than The Flight of the Concords? Yes. Are they weirder than Ted and Peter of the Basement? Yes. Okay. By far. Um, so they, they come out and they're dressed like clowns. And... Uh, oh, no. Did I scare them away? No. Pro no. I want to have Lance Armstrong and Louis Armstrong in the basement at the same time. I think, well, Lance isn't dead, but Louis is. Oh, what got him? The cancer? I don't know. He was like an old jazz guy, so... That was a Lance Armstrong cancer joke. Oh, that's terrible. Well, it's okay, because he cheated. He faked his cancer, right? Isn't that how he cheated? <laughs> what? No, I'm kidding. No, there was a football player who faked a girlfriend, though. Really? Yeah, but you were telling a different story. I'll save my football fake girlfriend story for next time. North four squares and east three squares to fire mountain. You'll find anything that gives you strength to easily lift anything. We should do that first. Yeah, we should. I mean, so next. north four. We've already done several things first. Right. North four. East, east three. three. Three squares. Oh, yeah. Gonna have to okay. put that in a tag. North four, east three. North four, east three. North four, E3. Going to E3 this year? Yeah, keep jumping out of the boat. You do keep jumping out of the boat. Out of the boat. <laughs> You're out and about outside of the boat. <laughs> North 4. Yeah, that East time three. down was the highest note. Da, 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 da. That is weird. Right. So North 4, East 3. 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3. So this is going to be the fastest to go here. And then go what? down. What? No, 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 no. Oh, why'd you go? Why? There was one that was like North 4, East 2. Oh. Wait, do you count the square you start in? I don't think you do. Mm -mm. Well, we're, we're, we were at the bottom of the screen, right? Yeah, so if I pull Go back the to the map. map here. Oh, I have it pulled up off screen. Oh, because you're not in the middle of warping. Okay, that's okay. Right, so we were down here, so one. Don't one. touch it trying to move the stupid mini map thing out of the way so I can see there okay one, one two, two three four one two three. Oh, so you're totally south. right so we'll just go south so we'll just go south okay tell your story <sighs> so they walk out and they're dressed like clowns right I'm really <laughs> glad you remembered it <laughs> <laughs> and um, they're not known for this kind of comedy like they're known like he's like two great comedians da, da, da. they walk out and they're just and clowns. they're dressed like clowns and they're like hey Hey everybody, ha huh? honk honk! And they're like, <laughs> like those typical like weird clowns, and um, that's pretty good. <laughs> and so like, Colbert is like, "Hey, it's so good to see you guys. I wasn't, uh, I didn't realize that you guys are gonna be dressed like clowns. Like, what's the deal with that?" And uh, <laughs> Tim Heidecker goes, "Well, you know, this last year I had a really bad divorce, and uh, <laughs> it's just been, it's it's been tough." And we've just found that when we're, you know, doing the whole clown thing, it makes me feel better. Wow. And then, and then Eric is like... Such a downer. And, and then, <laughs> Not funny at all. I, right, exactly. And so then Eric's like, yeah, and you know, this is the thing that I can do for my friend. Uh, hey, man, let's make sure that there's nothing super important here. We have to shoot an ice arrow at it. We did that already. Yeah, did we get ice arrows? Yeah, it gave us ice and fire arrow. Oh yeah, time. Robert Frost would be proud. Right. But anyway, so so he's like, yeah, I do this to like kind of help my friend. Cause, uh, oh. That is so beautiful. Because I, cause I care about him, you know? Those swirlies. And, and so... <laughs> so then they... Uh, so he's like, well, hey, uh, why don't you do some of your comedy for us? Or like, okay. So then like this like really stupid uh, like 
circus music comes on, like, burp, 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 and then, like, walk out. And, like, hey, dead hey, hey. arrow. I'm trying to figure out, how do I, oh, switch arrow. <laughs> Tell him this. Nope. St- oh, gosh. There. I'm doing the buttons it's telling me to do, but, uh, maybe there. There we go. So this stupid music comes on. Boom, 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 boom. They're like, hey, 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 and they're honking and stuff, and, and, um, <laughs> they get out to the center of the stage, and uh, the, the 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 depressed guy is like make makes a little bit of joke like, "Hey, what's uh what's the funniest thing that happened to you this week?" And the, and the other guy is like, "Oh, you know, I got a pie in the face." He's like, "My wife used to make pie." <laughs> and then like he'll spin off on this like really depressing <laughs> story, and they're both dressed like clowns, and it's like he's killing the mood, you know? Yeah. <laughs> So and they just do not this, funny at all. And then yeah, and then they just do that like five times. <laughs> it was really, really awkward and super funny. Can Ted reach the end before the timer is up? Find out next time. In, in the, the basement. basement. Ah! Oh shoot! <laughs> <laughs>